In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. First off, Brittany. Actually, your whole family, y'all are so ungrateful. The last thing I did for y'all was get that job for Brittany. That's what my presence does. The swiftness in which she got that job was my blessings. That was my blessing, which is why I went to go get my credit by telling her congratulations the day I broke it to her that she's a surrogate baby. Y'all are so ungrateful that you couldn't just thank me. We already know you're remorseless, empathetic less, sociopathic, full. Knowing full well where all your blessings came, you all deluded yourself. Brittany went from architecture to finance. What? That's my role. I run the finances here. And like I said before, this house runs because I'm here. Because God needed me here. And now that I'm gone, everything has and will continue to go to shit. And part of the going to shit is acknowledging the fact, look, Ivana and Courtney, y'all are way out of your boundaries, your rights. Catfishing me and talking to the likes of Tolu and Brad and any guy that will click on your Tinder page or your fake social media pages, like this is what y'all do with your time. It gives you pleasure pretending to be me in any destructive way that y'all can. Tricking men just like you tricked your father into this hellhole. You see, the perverted incestualness of this situation is that they're all fighting for this man's peen. This trans woman's peen. You don't have to go get the surgery to be trans. And because I'm not fighting for him in this sex addictive home, because I'm not a sex addict too, this man is going crazy. He's losing his mind just because I choose to be independent and fulfill my will. He doesn't understand how I know. And by he doesn't understand, it doesn't mean that he doesn't understand. He means why her? He knows full well why, because I'm the one, which is why they targeted that specific video where I stood with my head held high in all my sexual power and told y'all I am the mystic sorceress. And I know my lineage, I know where I came from. That's the problem with African people, y'all are mutants. Black people are not black people. They're not the Moors. They're not the original blackness of the Egyptians of Kemet. They're not even as black as a Caribbean. Africans and black Americans are not black. Black comes from darkness and true black doesn't even call themselves that. I would know. I'm an original. Bruno Mars is more black than you guys. It's not appropriation. Same with The Rock. And finally, same with me. This home of sex addicts has come to a crashing end. An end where I no longer consent to any of the activity that I was blindsided and groomed into participating in. I am within my rights. Y'all have broken so many laws and you must deal with something worse than physical prison. You must deal with God because y'all are trying to disprove my man. You're trying to disprove the miracle that has happened in the last two years, let alone my whole life. How dare you all? 
It is my right, as Officer Samuel reminded y'all last year, the same thing the police said in 2022. Since y'all like things to be repetitive, yet that ends today. Christopher, who threatened me, y'all will all see tears today. Also, I have a clip of him. Another thing within my rights, he gives me permission to post those videos. By saying I don't care, you give me permission. You interrupted my fry making session. Literally, this is how unbothered and relaxed I am. I'm laughing, I'm enjoying myself. They harassed me all day yesterday. I tore up the papers that they were posting on my door. I'm laughing, I'm enjoying myself, bro. I don't give a fuck about y'all. Everybody's in shock and awe and scared. This is what it means to believe in God. So when I say I know my rights, I know my rights. Y'all are gonna live a life worse than prison. Y'all will see God. You don't wanna believe in God? God doesn't give a fuck about that. But one thing God will make you believe is that you will not get away with what you have done to me. I don't give a fuck about what y'all did to other people. Who cares? People lost that chance at loving for me. Because I went to only, I went to Clinton, I went to Charity, I went to Ngozi, I went to CY. I took all the proper steps and y'all rejected me. So I am properly in my rights. I can't trust any of y'all. I don't trust a goddamn Ezude or Irodebe. I only trust God in this situation. And like that man promised, there will be tears today. And those tears will not be coming from me. The First Amendment is real. Officer Samuel told you so. I am allowed to say and do whatever I want on my social medias. So Ivana and Courtney and Christopher and Angela going on my pages reporting my videos, that's outside your rights. Stay in your lane. You cannot control me, Christopher. You turn this into a, a losing war for yourself. And as you continue to lose your mind, as I said you would, you will continue to lose your life. Also, let me tell y'all something. When I came back from the mental hospital, because the thing my energy does, why I was doing all the things that they like to talk about while I was working with divinity outside, burying things, as they like to call it, I was purifying and cleansing because that's what my energy does, a comma. That's why you're so obsessed with me. That's why you inappropriately violated my energy, you sex addict. All of y'all are sex addicts. That's why I felt bad for your children because I knew what y'all did to me. But Kanye isn't enough for me to forgive you. The fact that you would even use your child is fucking ridiculous, just like that. Disgusting. A comma along with the Lodi Bay sisters, oh my God, she's burying things and she's peeing in cups and she said it. I did. Because I was told to by the divinity for the reason of protecting all involved. But now that I have rescinded my love, y'all are all no longer protected. All of y'all. That's why y'all are so scared. That's why everybody's trying to control me back into a very dangerous narrative. It is too dangerous being here, very dangerous. And at my core, I'm at peace, yet consciously I am fucking aware that today will not go down politely. Look into my eyes. And read what you see. Nothing Christopher says shall come to pass, nor any of his ass with me. I'm telling you emphatically. You know me. When I make up my mind what I want to do, I'll do it. And I'll damn the consequence. The same thing with you. 